Welcome back to Forger, everyone. It's actually like a decent time of day, 8.30 p.m., 8.38 p.m., let me be exact here. We're back here in Forger, and you should be seeing this video along a Game Raiders Week of video. Unless you just don't watch the Forger videos, then, you, then why am I talking like the person that wouldn't watch it would be hearing what I'm saying. But yeah, we're back here in Forger. A roadmap has been announced, been revealed. Hold up, let's go, let's go to the main menu. Because... A roadmap has been revealed. Hopefully, if I click on this, it doesn't exit me out of the game. Please not. Okay. Oh, here we go. So, there's farm life. Obviously, now it's combat update. And I think this one is the modding one. Well, I'll put it on the screen, the actual shit. They, they got a lot coming, though. But, yeah, it's supposed to be farm life slash, you know, quality of life changes, a bunch of other stuff. Combat update. This is going to include a hardcore mode, some other stuff. This is supposed to be a modding support update right here, so mods can come to this game. Mods for this game are going to be insane. Uh, and then there's the multiplayer update, which is going to be coming in winter of 2019 or 2020, something like that. I will put the roadmap on the screen somewhere, eventually. It should have popped up on the screen already if it hasn't. But yeah, we are here. Now, I'm trying to play through this game slowly because if I'm honest, this game is not the longest game if you just you know sit there and play through it. And that's what a lot of people did. People just played it for hours and hours straight. And it's a really addicting game, so it's understandable. But me, I'm trying to I'm trying to enjoy my time in it. Even though I do have another save where I did pretty much play through to the end. Kind of. Why is the chicken in the fountain? How often does that happen? He's probably stuck there forever. But yeah. I'm trying to take my time on the YouTube playthrough. The stream playthrough is pretty far in. And uh, you know, just been taking our time, you know, trying to enjoy the game for every every ounce that the game offers i'm just trying to enjoy it right now let's capture this fairy multiple fairies the thing is don't i have this already completed hmm. 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 or not completed but do i have one in here yeah i do have one in here sweet what, what, what else am i missing what bug is that this is like a firefly i don't know what the fuck that is but yeah uh we should probably start doing stuff for the museum soon I don't know. We're about to level up. I don't know what to do if I'm being honest. Maybe should we should just start expanding the uh, snow biome. I have been told that I should probably get my hands on banks. I don't know why I said it like that. Banks. Because banks, they make money while we sleep. Passive income, baby. You guys ever see those like vending machine videos rec in your recommended in uh, on YouTube? I always get these vending machine videos in my recommended where... People are, they get a vending machine business and they're like, passive income, baby. You get money while you sleep, baby. <laughs> it's like, you're not wrong, but it's very slow money. Well, I guess if it's like a gumball vending machine, it's pretty slow. But let's do it. Let's get banking. This is my first time getting banking in any playthrough. I have not done it. We just acquire some bricks. Yes, sir. I know about bricks. Let's go ahead. I don't know why the fuck I said I know about bricks. What is that even supposed to mean? I don't know what that means. But yeah, the goal, make some money, explore the snow biome. That's the goal right now. If we can do that, I will be happy. Speak about exploring the snow biome. Hey, you barely gave me shit. Okay, it's all good. We got 7.09K right now. What can we buy with that? We can buy this? Yes, sir. Let's do it. So I think this one is the um, crafting obelisk, which if you can't tell by its name, it just gives you a bonus for you know stuff that is crafted. Something like that. And, uh, it's okay. It's okay. I think it gives you also XP for, uh, for buildings. It's either XP for building stuff or it's XP for crafting things. It's something like that. But I, obviously, I can't even use it because we got seven minutes going on. Now, the thing about the buffs, from what I know, you can't switch them out. Like, I understand you're only allowed to have one at a time, but why are you not able to, you know, switch them out? You have to wait. You have to wait it out. Is the game louder than me? I feel like it's louder than me. So I got some fireflies that we can finally turn into the druid right here. Wait, don't we need a key? I'm gonna make a key just in case. This is a druid, right? I don't know. I'm just. I'm just assuming it's kind of fucked up. Hey, I finally got your fireflies, bro. Thank you for the critters. No problem. You may keep the magic scrolls as a reward. Well, shit. Yeah, that's gonna work out because uh, we need we need these for the magic thing. <laughs> We need it for the museum. Which part of the museum? I don't know, to be honest. Is it this one? No, it's this one. 
it is foraging because this scroll this specific scroll there's a little something something hold up let me kill him with that so we get the meat from it yeah this scroll let's go ahead let's bring it to like over here oh let me harvest you not you the deer boom look at that beautiful i know right very beautiful you know what might as well take these flowers because these flowers are actually required for the museum now i'm focusing on the museum a little bit this episode along with us trying to explore the whole snow biome now i haven't explored much of the snow biome on any other saves just a little just a little piece of it here and there but nothing too major can i get a golden egg no y'all just really don't want to give me a golden egg my inventory is feeling awfully full so let's go do this again over here so, i don't know <laughs> just to get it out of my inventory oh i should have fucking sold it all right let's build these banks Be oh wrong thing build these banks beautiful money making machines right here uh let's let's god i almost got hit because of that bad positioning maybe i should expand this island a little bit more be the way to go make this money island or maybe just do this connect these now i really should get a flower press but i don't know i feel like buying certain skills is a waste of money but not a waste of money a waste of skill points and skill points they get harder to come by later on but we could always just break the structure and add it in oh i should buy these i really should yeah let's do it i just spent a lot of money on doing that it's all good we're gonna sell all these until we uh, we're at 10 of each 10 of each it's always nice to have a good bit of these bro honestly what the fuck are crystals even used for actually i think they are used for something but yeah let's this is gonna be money island right here all right this island too is gonna be a part of it and we're gonna have more markets because it's good to have more markets more items you can buy because all markets aren't the same they have a chance of being the same you know what i mean like it's rng and they both markets have cookies in them but that's a very very low chance and i'm willing to take that low low chance for this and this beautiful how much money do they make i have no idea there's a perk to make them make more money but uh you know i think we'll, we'll stay away from that for now let's head back in here because we're slowly finishing up the museum well slowly finishing up certain parts of the museum boom there's a bunch of cinder blooms i think that's what they're called i actually don't think that is but i'm just gonna assume that's what it's called but yeah another thing we can do is get milk from these guys oh here's a new quest i'm afraid the natural resource exploitation is still going rampant could you bring me some tree saplings so i can make sure the forest is safe bro i had this dude tripping he talking mad shit he like he low-key sneak dissing us if you guys read his dialogue look what i just did for this forest look how often everything grows like this dude sneak dissing us he just he's just having something to complain about for fun but uh i think we need five bottles of milk milk and then we can buy uh or not buy what the fuck am i talking about and we can finish this part of the quest what, wasn't this episode supposed to be about me exploring the uh, snow biome hey back up here going to the snow biome 9.57k in our inventory uh let me talk to this guy real quick not talk to this he's a fucking magical deer let's buy land this one is next oh that's the dungeon let's do it let's do the dungeon then make sure we got everything good yep i don't know what the hell i just said make sure we got food in our inventory is really the only thing we need let's do it baby it's dungeon time this dungeon is easy i'm a genius when it comes to dungeons in general all right boom Somebody told me to always mine the materials in here. I guess. I don't know. It kind of fills my inventory. You have to get more XP when you mine the materials in here. I don't know. Oh, that's an enemy. Hold up. Take out the... Oh, shit. Take out the lightning staff. Get your ass. Oh, that was, that was actually really close. I, I, I didn't know how they attacked. Or I forgot how they attacked. Oh, we do have to mine all this, man. They're making me mine it anyways. I should get some bombs. I don't think I've ever used a bomb yet. I've seen them for sale. Same thing with EMP grenades. I've seen them for sale. I've never used them. But yeah, I have done this dungeon. I've done like most of the dungeons. I know how to do them. Oh, give me these flowers. These are actually very important. Very important because I need to finish those. Boom, we take the minecart down here. No enemies, please. Oh, God, there's enemies. Ooh, do it. Y'all seen the dodges. Even though it wasn't even close to hitting me, y'all seen the dodges. 
All right, pay respects. Let's get that one set up right there. Hmm. Isn't there some? There's a certain something we have to get at some point in time in this dungeon. Uh, we have to get like a staff or something. Let me eat up. Let me eat this. We do need to keep the uh, citruses for a little certain something. I keep on saying certain something. But uh, yeah, we do need to keep the citruses for stuff. I'll just use it now for the XP. Let's go. Hold up. Gonna get that. Let's go. Am I missing something? Was there something I was supposed to do somewhere? Here. This is what I'm supposed to do. Let's turn this up here. Turn this one down here. Turn this one around. Boom. Oh, make sure you break that. And then this laser should open up this wall up here. Should lead us to the next area. Boom. We still got a bow in our Shovel Knight cosplay. I don't really know if I want a bow in my Shovel Knight cosplay. I don't think he looks that cool. But it's all good. We'll keep it for now. Maybe I'll change the character I'm playing as. We probably unlocked a couple more things, a couple more feats. But uh, we'll have to see. So we gotta break this. Get the flowers. Hell yeah, I'll take the flowers. Go ahead, take the pixie too. Which I'm taking that minecart. Oh, more flowers. What are these even called? Nightshade? I think these are nightshade. I don't know. Yeah, we're taking this up here. And this should lead us to the next area. Yes, sir. Kill this guy before he even gets a chance. Don't even let him get the chance. Oh, there's another one. Don't even let him get the chance. All right, so this next one. We can walk through here. Okay. Do this. 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 Uh-huh. That unlocks that. Make sure we turn this one this way. And then in here, we turn this one that way. Boom. And then we push the minecart. I know, I'm a genius, I'm a genius. Look at this, nice and easy. And that should break this open and we should be getting the staff that we need. I'm gonna take out the sword just in case. Who's in here? I know there's a, no, no, I not. Boom. Ice rod, use it to freeze objects and enemies. Okay, so it freezes enemies, nice to know. So we still need the boss key, let's take this back. And I know there's a secret room somewhere. Isn't there a secret room right there against that wall or some shit? I'm pretty sure. You can see the cracks in the wall right there. The thing is, I don't know how to open them. Is this how you just open them? Yeah. <laughs> but uh, I know about that secret room because when I did this on stream, one of the enemies shot the secret room open on accident. But now, what we have to do is... or Well, we can get some good loot right here. Go like this. Go like that. Oh, wait, never mind. Wait, yeah, no, no, I'm doing it right. Let's wait for that again. Boom, boom. Then let that melt off. Boom. Free loot. I will take it. That's some good money right there. Some good gems, which is also more money. Uh, next up, we get the key. I think there's some more loot we can get somewhere else, too, though. But yeah, to get the key, we do this, right? And then we do this. Boom. Key has been gotten. Right, boom the key has been gotten now the other place there was a door somewhere this one here it is you do this this and that's how you get in here i'm hoping there's a a harpy or not a harpy a fairy in here because i'm too lazy to eat all right fine i'll eat click a couple times making it harder for me what's the loot looking like all right we're still we still got a lot of room because no, obviously, I feel like, I don't know why it's not programmed. Maybe it's too hard to program. I don't know. But chest, if you have an item in a vault, slash chest, whatever you want to call it. Uh, the item, if you're in a dungeon, doesn't go to the vault. It doesn't go inside of it. It just goes into, into your inventory. All right, the boss is right here. Are we ready for this? Not really. Whatever. I'm ready for this. Arrow time. Boom. Boom. Oh, shit. Boom. No, I probably should have came a little bit more prepared than this. But it's all good. There's actually not really much many ways I could have prepared for this. Use the lightning. I almost walked into that. Use the lightning. We can't really roll when we're using the lightning, it seems like. Oh, set it on fire. That's a big ass. Oh, dodge. Y'all seen that? Hey, bless up for the dodge percentage. That boss is actually tough. 
the boss when I fought that boss in the my other character is really easy because <laughs> I'm not that strong use it to increase your stats yes sir beautiful there you go <laughs> boss slash dungeon complete and now we got a bunch of items in our inventory uh let's see here Who wants to get shot with an arrow the tree I'll be a nice person I'll, I'll shoot the tree even though obviously that's still nature and that's still kind of fucked up whatever it's not a chicken it's fine uh what, what did it say what did it give me oh give me one of these spirit orb let's put up a uh we put up our damage because like i said we were doing low damage during that boss so i'm gonna put up our damage higher for the next boss slash set of enemies what can i put here i didn't finish jalapenos really okay i can finish the nightshade now i hope that's what that's called i'm not even sure no maybe that one's nightshade and maybe this one something else but yeah we still have cinder bloom death blossom i don't know what the hell those flowers are called so we still got, we still got a little bit more all right we're gonna buy uh another piece of land oh i haven't talked to this guy for a while maybe i should set up a farm i don't know i'm hoping that farms like corral enemies or not enemies corral animals so they're all in the same area but i'm not sure i haven't done any farm stuff waiting for that farm life update <laughs> now let's is this even snow i don't i don't i don't snow if it is let's get a let's get the 7k one in the middle oh is that a puzzle no it's not a puzzle i know what this is oh look i know exactly what this is i don't know if we can actually do the quest yet though it's a problem peep this walk in the middle boo there's a ghost can you appear again thank you boo did i scare you i am trying to get better at scaring people you guys like that sound like the spongebob ghost i think i may need help perhaps you can help me maybe if you bring me a couple of demon horns i can actually look scarier <gasps> the shop is scaling scan the shop is scared why did i say it twice the shop is selling demon horns watch you gonna refresh because i'm having troubles getting over there one two perfect perfect timing actually how much was left on the shop a minute we had a while i had to fuck up a lot if i wanted to miss out on that bro i swear there's always things in the, my direct path of where i need to go always makes me go around man i just want a direct path cough it up what kind of goodies you got for me i am totally going to look terrifying now here keep this old treasure as a reward for your troubles that's it some money what else you got boo don't worry my friend it's just me oh thank god it's just him <laughs> i bet you were terrified i think i can be even scarier it kind of sucks that he doesn't like put the horns on on his sprite but it require a very specific rare item oh god is that a kapala bro i got a kapala in the stream playthrough i don't even remember where i got the kapala i had two of them no idea where i got two of them but uh I don't know how easy it is gonna be to get that. I don't know how easy it is to get, you know, the archaeology stuff for the museum. Oh, should I harvest these? You just press E on these, right? Cough up the cash, boys. That's actually not that much cash. Can we open up another island? Real question. Excuse me for that like burp hiccup. I don't know why it was like hiccup and burp at the same time. But it's like really silent. 10k? Alright, no problem. I sold all of my crystals. How many do we have in our inventory now? Three. Sold all of them. We slowly got some back. This is about to restock. What you about to restock with? Let me see. Let me see the goodies that are about to drop. Let me level up again, man. We need something to farm. You know, I know the next biome we can farm some stuff, but oh, look at that landfill. I'm about to cop. I love landfill. Bro, oh, should I do it? Should I do it? I'll buy, I'll buy like two, two landfill, just to show you guys if you don't know what I'm talking about. Why I want landfill so badly? You ready for this? Break those, and you put the land in. It fills in the land. It's insane, right? It looks everything look way nicer. Maybe that'll be like an end goal of the series. Fill in all the water with the land. Okay, maybe not all the water, but a lot of water. How do you even take out land? There has to be an item that you can take out land with. I don't know, maybe it's like a later shovel, late game shovel that you get. Yeah, can we buy one more piece of land? It was just 10K, right? Something like that? I don't know. Cough up some more money for me. Okay, you know, that's pretty much more money. 
Why does it gotta be in my direct path? Look, look what I tell you guys, there's always something in my direct path. Violent is 10.7k, okay. Well, we can get that real quick then. I think we're gonna get this piece of land and end off the episode on that. Because my fucking voice, or not my voice, my throat hurts from talking. Boom. Is that enough? Yep, it's 11.7k. Hey, we might be able to buy the island to the left. If I can buy to the one to the left, I'm gonna do it, alright? Boom. Oh, we can. Who the fuck is that? Spelunky? What you mining, my guy? Mine it. Do it. Do it. <laughs> hey, fellow miner, help me get this crystal. How many hits does it take to get to the bottom of this crystal? Oh, this takes a while. I think I'm gonna do this though. <laughs> it's getting closer and closer. This actually was really quick. Is there a chest underneath it? I built a key, so I hope so. It's just a bunch of gems, all right. You got anything to give me? Well, that was fun. You probably hit the thing like 10 fucking times. Look, I'm a little sperm cell with a top hat. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. More Forger coming. Uh, maybe we'll see another episode throughout Game Raiders Week 2. I don't know. Because like I said, I'm trying to post a Game Raiders, or not a Game Raiders, a Terraria video every day this week up until Wednesday because I started on Wednesday and we're going until the next Wednesday. But yeah, I will see y'all in the next episode of Forager. Leave some comments giving me things to do.